On the surface, George seems a charming, foolish old man. But who is he? And who was he? George Sprott is a story about time, identity, loss, and the pervasiveness of memory. Hey, George, I'm Pete Outerbridge, the host of the Doug Wright Awards. Check your mail for an invitation. Huh? Oh, drifting. Should get to that mail. George, read the invitation. George, you've been nominated for a Doug Wright Award. <laughs> Odd dream. But isn't that Peter Outerbridge handsome? Back and Forth is a novel in 90 lino cuts. It examines what it means to belong, to assimilate, to be distant, and to challenge the constraints of time and space. Hi, it's Pete Outerbridge here. Is this the girl from Back and Forth? Okay, yeah. I'm, I'm not sure of your name since there, there aren't any words in your book. And I'm, I'm, not, I'm not really sure what you're saying. Okay, look, I, 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 just, I want to invite you to Toronto to the, the Doug Wright Awards. You've been nominated. I, I hope you're saying that you can make it. Peter Outerbridge sounds dreamy. Red documents the powerful story of a leader blinded by revenge. When the pages of this Haida manga are arranged in a specific order, the panels of the narrative create a Haida formline image. Please be careful, Peter. Red doesn't like award shows. But this award is different. It's very prestigious. Red! Are you there? Come out. You've been nominated for a Doug Wright Award. Huh? What is it, sir? I don't know. Something's following us. To the beach, now! Stay away, Peter. I don't care how handsome you are. Please reconsider. Part art monograph, part comics collection, Hot Potato seamlessly combines decade-plus comics activities with a lifelong devotion to, as author Mark Bell calls it, fine artworks. And these layers of the earth did rise, and did drink unto themselves from the soda pop. Introducing Guston. Gustin built his home there, in the curve of that layer of the earth there. Inside! I ought to get one of those doohickeys that only allow outgoing calls. Hello and good evening, caller. Hi, Gustin. Pete Outerbridge here. You're invited to Ontario for the Doug Wright Awards. Uh... I'll send some of those bug things to bring you. Hmm... And those bug things carried Gustin through the air. And Gustin fell asleep as they crossed the Ontario border. And Gustin dreamed of meeting Peter Outerbridge. Allegedly raised in a dark cellar and deprived of human contact until the age of 16, Kaspar tells the strange story of Kaspar Hauser. The cellar I have always lived in is about six feet long and four feet wide. I have a wooden horse. When I wake up, there is a piece of bread at my side and a little jug of water. It never occurs to me to want to stand up. One day, a man in black with beautiful golden hair appears. Caspar, I have to take you to Toronto. Peter takes my two arms and puts them around his neck. He smells really good. You've been nominated for a very prestigious award. I start to cry because I'm so happy for being nominated. 
and because the handsomest man in the world is now my friend, but mostly because he has stopped keeping me in his cellar. Congratulations, Congratulations to, to all, all the nominees. nominees.